In today's video, we're going to show you how to test a coolant temperature sensor using something simple boiling water and a multimeter. Here's what you'll need for this test, a coolant temperature sensor, a digital multimeter, a pot of boiling water and stove, and finally, a thermometer to measure the water temperature first. Let's take a quick look at how a coolant temperature sensor works. This sensor is a thermistor, meaning its resistance changes with temperature. Most coolant temperature sensors are negative temperature coefficient NTC, meaning resistance decreases as temperature increases. Let's prove this with boiling water. Step 1. Connect your digital multimeter to the sensor terminals. Set the multimeter to the resistance ohm setting. Make sure your connections are secure with alligator clips or probe leads. Step 2. Carefully place the sensor in the hot water. Make sure the metal tip of the sensor is fully submerged, but don't let the water reach the electrical connections. Note the resistance of the sensor at room temperature. It should be relatively high, depending on your sensor model. Step 3. Heat the water to boiling. Use your thermometer to monitor the temperature. As you can see, the resistance values drop as the water temperature rises. This confirms that the sensor is working correctly. If your sensor doesn't show these changes or if the resistance stays constant, it might be time to replace it. Now removing the sensor from the hot water. As it starts to cool down, we observe the resistance on the multimeter. Watch how the resistance increases as the sensor cools. This happens because the sensor's internal thermistor is designed to react to temperature changes increasing resistance as the temperature decreases. Thanks for watching, and if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more automotive tips and tricks.